Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and I thought I'd show you how to design this. It'd be a pretty cool part of any engraving. It would be vector art, and uh, you could do it, put it anywhere, and have some fun with it. It'd make a pretty good start of somebody's logo, or just to get some attention, or just to add a little bling to your drawing. So the spiral tool, which is underneath your polygon tool, and if you'll just type in the letter A, when you don't have the text tool picked, it'll give you the spiral tool. So that shortcut is A. Hold down the control button so it will be equal. And this is what really started this because I thought I'd show you how to make this line thicker. We're going to go to Effects and go to Contour. And we're going to contour a quarter of an inch. And we're going to use rounded corners. On this contour so our end won't be sharp then go to arrange and break contour apart now if you will click in the center it should grab the center one and just hit delete so you've done probably the hardest part let's go control D and make a duplicate of that holding down the control button let's move it over but now let's flip it let's flip it the other way this is the mirror vertically and mirror horizontally and you just kind of get where it's like that. Now you see the rounded part of the contour. It'll make it look really good. So let's zoom in here. And get that node right there. And with your four part handle. It'll snap to that other node. Now just take these and go to your well tool. And you don't really have to do it right now. But it'll just kind of show you what's going to happen. So that would be pretty cool within itself. But now this is welded together. Let's control D and make a duplicate. And let's rotate this 90 degrees. Now let's take our weld tool and select everything and hit weld again. And it took out those inner cuts. Then just take your smart fill tool and get to an inner size cut and fill that in. And then remember if you're going to cut this out you need to right click no outline and that way you can just kind of see and and because the smart fills tool is there you might have to drag that away so there's our smart fill and then just delete this one this one has no outline so that's a pretty cool design just kind of playing around and show you what the spiral tool could do Hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.